So I got this also from the sharing tree during the $5 fill a bag sale. That is why I love the sharing tree. That is why I will always be dedicated to the sharing tree whenever they have a $5 bag day sale. I go, it's almost every other Saturday or I think it's like every first Saturday of the month. Anyway, I go and I fill that bag up for $5 and this was only one of the many slew of items that I got in my $5 bag. I packed most of the stuff because we're trying to move <clears throat> um, or we'll be moving on the first. So we won't be trying to, we'll be moving on the first. So um, this is teaching guides. I did not think much of it when I saw it sitting in that, um, that pile however it said manipulatives on it down here and that kind of drew my attention and when you open it it has a little welcome thing there I don't know if you see it. and then it goes these tabs here are everything that's pretty much in here but some of these don't have tabs for them but anyway it's just a teaching guide on all the different manipulatives that you can think of there is bear family map there's count and sort, there's dinosaur, there's farm animal math, there is money, mini motors, links, geo boards, pattern blocks, pentominoes, tangrams, time, everything you can think of. Um, there are so many different manipulatives to teach here. I don't even know if we're going to get to everything, but I'm going to try. I'm, I'm really going to try um, the Tangrams. Actually, I think I'm going to try that one first. So, there's all these different manipulatives in here. Um, yeah, it's a lot. There's time, fruit and vegetable counters, dominoes, attribute blocks, jewels, beads and laces. I mean, color tiles everything and they really go into detail about what um, to teach and how to teach it tells you how to introduce the tiles to the child how to um, how to start with them like you can start color sorting you can start color words constructions and it gives you little um, sheets in here that you can actually use with the child too with the uh, manipulative so I have to admit that out of everything that I got that day this was definitely the best thing that I got because we have a lot of these things the manipulatives we have a lot of them we don't have all of them but we have a lot of them i didn't have the geo boards but i found it today i found it today <laughs> for three dollars um you can't see it's such a glare in here anyway i found the geo boards today for three dollars and it came with everything that went with it that would have came with this guide because I actually googled all the, the different things that come with this guide and what they're supposed to look like and everything so I kind of have like a mental memory of what all it's supposed to have and if I don't I just google it on my phone but yeah I went into the store and I found it I took it all out of the box because the box is kind of old and rickety and you know we you know how boxes are so I have the geo boards in here I have a whole bunch of rubber bands in different sizes and colors I just put them up with my homeschooling stuff um, when I pack so I don't have them on my person per se to show you but I do and I'm going to use those and then it has like these little there's about 13 or 16 of these little um, board, cardboard things in here that kind of it gives you a scenario and it tells you to make something with it and um, now make some other houses and it's just it's really a cool little system I never even you know I don't know I just never thought that that kind of stuff would be that educational I guess I, I don't know but as I'm reading and learning more and seeing kids actually using these things like YouTubing things to see if they're actually worth the the time and the energy I'm realizing now how important these little small things are in the child's development and just all kinds of different ways for them to think differently so yes I'm I'm learning I'm getting there <laughs> um, it's taking me some time but I'm getting there and also um, I found a whole bunch of these little pattern blocks um, they call them all kinds well they're manipulatives that also go with some of the things in there I found a whole bunch of them these pentominoes I had no idea what these were um, they're pentominoes and basically they're like um, Tetris. I, I, I call them Tetris things. So 
<laughs> if you hear me say it, I'm like, oh, he was playing with a little Tetris thing. Okay, that's what this is. These, are, these remind me of a little Tetris thing. So, yeah, I got a whole bunch of these. I think each bag was 50 cents, and I got like six bags in there. So, yeah, I'm, I'm building up my manip manipulatives that I don't have. But, yeah, that was definitely worth the purchase for sure because I'm actually having fun learning how to teach them these things. And finding that teacher's guide to really tell me how to do all of it was just over the top awesome. We went to the Dollar Tree. After I got that, I also got this kindergarten little, um, it says Learning Fun Workbook Volume 2 for ages 4 plus. I got this for Ari. Um, I got the Time and Money Adventures in Learning, Telling Time, Money Values, and Comprehension Skills. This was actually for Raina. She has started doing some of it my little my soon to be second grader so she's gonna be doing that you're gonna be second grader honey i know what i'm talking about and then i found the reading premium education for grade three i know she's going to second grade but like i said i'm planning ahead and trying to get different things that i think she might be interested in i went to walmart too and i got this um little kit and it was only a dollar fifty and it's like a little it has all these little apples and a little thing in the middle it's like a bulletin board decorator but i kind of figured i could use it for something else in the room so i don't know well, at least i got the u.s government um social studies it was two dollars at the sharing tree it just has little uh trivia in here about the u.s government it says that the interest level would be from six to adult so that's my range at this point um so it has different things in here that they can, you know, define, like define liberty and rights and amendment article and document. Um, and it has uh, word searches and crosswords that they can do. I also got these reading rods alphabet from Sharon Tree. They were only two dollars um, and they're pretty much like the uh, spelling things that I see people using um, UC spelling or something like that or. I've seen a lot of people using them. I can't remember what they're called, but anyway, they're just, and they're different colors for like the vowels and stuff, so. And it has like a little booklet to kind of get you started in there. So I figured instead of paying all that money for that kind of stuff, I can just, I can just use this. <laughs> um, this was only $2, so yeah, there we go. I got my little, got my little things in there. Um, they were also at the sharing tree. Oh, this came from the Dollar Tree. I forgot about this, this cut in the glue. Um, with Cookie Monster, you basically cut out these things. You cut those things out and you put them in order. That's all. Because right now they're like mixed up, and then you just put them in order. This is a cute little book. I think Ari will enjoy doing with me. And then, oh yeah, I got the Sharing Tree had this Spanish grade two book. So I got this. It's actually pretty. It's a pretty cool book. Like it tells you the numbers from zero to ten. Um, you have the numbers there and then it also has like other little things and you 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 know do it in spanish the little dot to dot it has a bunch of good information in here we're probably going to start this my kids keep saying they want to do spanish but i would really like for them to learn french as well because it's actually what i knew when i was in elementary school i went to an eco eco long end which was actually a, a predominantly french school and they taught us french with muzzy and it was like all that i knew at one point so I would like them to learn French, but I, they probably don't want to. They just want to learn Spanish. So then I found these Expo Bright Stick fluorescent wet erase things at the Sharing Tree for a dollar, and I got some goodies, some books, uh, Horton Hears the Who and The Giving Tree. They were a dollar, and my last one was Summer Link Math Plus Reading for Grade One. I'm learning that it is a really nice book. Stop it. <laughs> so these are all the things that I got um, from my hauls that I've been doing. I have a whole lot more stuff to show you guys, but for right now, this is all I have, and I have to get back to my kids because I'm going to wring their little necks. I'll see you guys in my next haul. Bye.